just use the word that you don't use. I don't even use that word, but there are a lot of black folks looking with that the man when you used to walk around with no mess on. Hey, what's up, hood folks? This is Jeremy. Hello? Mm. Oh, you recording? No, I'm sitting here exercising. Oh, dang, you move fast. What's up, hood folks? This is Rashad. Oh, did you already say this is Jeremy? No. Oh. This is Jeremy. So today is Tuesday. <laughs> March 2nd. March 2, 2021. 24 more days before my 39th birthday. Shout out to all the March Madness babies in this motherfucker. Yes, I cuss on this channel. If you don't like cussing, go and watch it. I'm not going to be blanking nothing out. And I don't care about the kids. And I definitely don't care about if you call yourself sanctified and feel the Holy Ghost. Your funk ass don't know how to pray the coronavirus away a year later. <laughs> Bitch ass. Anyway. But today is March the 2nd. <laughs> and I have a taste. We have a taste. For what? Ham sandwiches. A uh, big ham sandwich. Now, I don't want to go to the wall barn to get no uncured ham in the package. Just too salty. So, we finna drive to Food Line. All the way to Food Line. All the way out of the way to Food Line. And we're gonna go to the deadly. Because one thing about Food Line sliced meat, they deadly meat is off the chain. It's that's banging. That's what you call premium. It's hidden. They have some good deadly meat. So, that's what we finna do. Go get some ham. I'm giving I'll probably get like four slices of ham. That's it. Just four slices of ham and that's it. That's IT. <laughs> and after that, we is gonna do what else? We're gonna go swimming. I don't know how to swim. <laughs> you know how to swim, you know how to swim a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. I don't know how to swim. I never took swimming lessons. I didn't either. So how you learn how to swim? Just getting thrown in the pool and making my way to the area where I can get out. That sound like a boost. <laughs> Good folks, y'all see my glasses. I, them old, I, them old glasses. I wear the glasses I've been wearing for the past year. Them Sean Comb glasses. It seemed like them glasses broke the bridge of my nose up. You know, the bridge right there, and it got it broke out. It's so it's like it's sore, and it's a pain that I don't know how to describe. I put some ointment on it. That's why you probably see this. So I went and looked in the cabinet. I mean, the bottom of the, the thing right here, and I found my old glasses. These my old, old glasses. I don't know what's up with them Sean Cone glasses. It like Puffy trying to do my eyes like big and cross them motherfuckers or something. Like, damn, got my... <laughs> it's like I'm sitting there with them glasses on, them glasses got my eye. My, just right here, just hurt like my sign hurt. So I took them glasses, I put the old glasses back on, and now it ain't, it's sitting get finna go away. But I don't like these glasses. I think I'm gonna have to just go on and just get me a ex real, cause these these little Walmart glasses. I'm gonna have to go and get me a nice, real expensive pair of glasses. I try to get glass. I want to get glasses every year, every year. But I probably just go and just get me a real nice five hundred dollar pair of glasses. That's gonna last you. That's gonna last. And but then my I, your vision changes almost every year. So so my vision get bad unless I. Get the nice glasses and get me some new lenses every year. I can't just keep the frames. But either or, I gotta do something because this really got my, it really get on my nerve right here. And I told you, you should have got some glasses similar to mine. I don't want no glasses. What kind of glasses number you got? Ray Bans. Look at that. Black folk love that every time. Ray Ban, Gucci, Chanel. Well, you know I had Ray-Bans in the past and they work good. They work good. They didn't trip like a lot of the other, uh, you know, store, you know, not store bought, but them America's Best glasses. Uh, I took some America Best. Well, I, mean, I, I got these from America Best, but they Ray-Bans. I should give me some uh, America's Best. That's why I should go give me some Ricky Smiley glasses. You know, I went to go look, that's what I was gonna get me too, some Ricky Smiley glasses, but they didn't have no pad that I liked. 
Oh yeah. Yeah, so I just got the Ray Bans. What about the all uh, Randy Jackson? Nah, I had some of those before and those those weren't good. Do y'all wear glasses? Where did y'all get y'all glasses from? I'm accepting advice. See? Here we go. You know how people say they hate unsolicited advice? Now I'm ask, asking for your solicited advice. Where if you wear glasses, where did you go get your glasses from? The, pay, the last two I done had has been from Walmart because it's been more convenient, but I think I'm gonna have to just step outside the box. And then plus, I got a fat head. <laughs> we know. And these with these glasses, the air for his to have a fat head. I got two fat, let me stop, that's nasty. But yeah, I got a fat head for real, so I need some glasses that gonna fit around my face. But I don't want my glasses to be real big, you know. But I don't want, I can't stand, now, no disrespect to nobody. I hope I hurt your feeling. But I can't stand with little Medicaid glasses. You know them little glasses that look like little uh, microchip slides over their eyes? Them little small little glasses that so, be square like this? Them little Medicaid glasses? 1970 pedophile glasses. Oh, them big, yeah, them big ass <laughs> Chief Gillespie glasses. Them big ass glasses I see a lot of people wearing. I don't want them, them Medicaid glasses. And I don't want them little glasses that look like microscope slides over your eyes. Them Medicaid glasses. No offense to Medicaid people. If I had to give me some, I'm going to wear but if I got other choices, I'm going to step outside the box. Also, y'all, I posted on Instagram last night. I made some uh, zucchini spaghetti. It was so good. It was so good. I, took, I bought my own two whole zucchinis and I shred them up myself. But I also did this last night too, y'all. Look at this shit him. Look at the camera. We're going to show y'all. It won't show y'all. Probably don't need to show y'all good. Y'all, when I was sitting there cleaning off the blade, that damn, what is it called? A mandarin? Mandarin, whatever that, whatever, whatever them blades called that you use to shred up or uh, stuff with. Look at that. Let me put it right here. Y'all, I cut the fuck out myself and it hurt it, but I didn't think it was bad. And then I'm looking down at the sink. I said, damn, I waste all this tomato sauce everywhere. Then I looked again, like, oh shit, that's my finger. So I start tripping, hollering like a little white bitch in a scary movie. Ah! And then this dude was get gone. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. And so my finger with that bleeding night bitch that opened up wide. I mean, it's raw. It didn't hurt so bad. And the way it feels, TMI information. So you don't like TMI, turn your camera off. I'm giving you a chicken, turn your camera off. I'm giving you a second, turn your, not camera, you turn your video off. Cause people be like, that's TMI, no warning. I'm giving you a warning. All right, you got your, you got your mic, you got, everybody got their phones off and their cameras, I mean, they video off, they don't want to hear this. The inside of my finger, how it raw feels, this is how it feel when you pull that foreskin back. <laughs> and you, like you getting head and it be hurt like, oh, 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 that's too hard. When you be pull, jacking that skin back and you sucking the head part, that raw feel, that just how that feel when I touch inside that finger, the exact same feeling and it do not, do not feel good. Ain't nobody sit up getting none and be like, oh yeah, baby, like get your ass up, I pull it, your motherfucker that. But it hurt though, it hurt, but it's healing. That mean my immune system is good. It's hit, even in a matter of less than 24 hours, it's still on the heel good. So, mm-hmm, you took your vitamins today. Get you some vitamins in your life. Yeah. And speaking, uh-oh. Speaking of, I just saw that Texas has list, lifted its mask mandate and businesses can start opening up 100%, 100% when? 100% March 10th. Woo! That's a sign for the Lord. <laughs> Gee, that was yeah, what I'm talking about. I was about. reading about that all this morning. That was um, what I'm talking about. It was like, because I know they were talking about it yesterday. I was reading it while I was at work. They were talking about, uh, you know, a Hot Wheels supposed to have made a... Uh, Who are Hot Wheels? Greg Abbott. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> supposed to be making a, uh, you know, a statewide, you know, announcement uh, or whatever, what have you. And then today when I looked at it, bam, he said, yeah, we're Texas on March 10th, Texas can open up 100%. All um, statewide ma uh, mass mandates will cease to exist. That's good. Now, I think people, if they want to steal with their mask, they should be allowed to steal with their mask. And it shouldn't be no sweat. You know, they, because I'm, you know, because you know how they might run this game again. This just could be my opinion. Now that people can don't have to wear masks no more, they'll be like, oh no, you can't wear your mask in the bank no more. Let's call the police on there for having their mask on. And that's some bullshit. So I think people should have a choice, a pro choice. Do what you want to do, your body, your way. I personally don't believe the mask work because I know people personally, like person to person, person to person, who the hell is just calling me? Person to person that um, well, wore masks nonstop and still caught the 
unspoken truth. Damn this hurt. Damn this hurt. Who is this calling me? Who is this calling? Somebody call. I get so sick of folk calling me. Let me stop the camera. So we done made it to the line. I to put my glasses on. The food line. line. The food line. They should be called the air, food L Y I N G, as in no. We lying about these cheap prices. <laughs> food lion, lion ass. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Come on, Paul, right here. I'm surprised. So whoever we is finna do a switcheroo. We finna turn this big camera off and we finna flip to a phone. You ready? Yeah. I didn't know this. Look at that. What? Like. It's a it's super steady mode. Whew. That's cool. Hey, hey, you need some pussy. I'm just learning. I'm still hey, learning the phone. Hey. Okay. I ain't learned my phone. I really ain't learned my phone. I haven't learned any of the features on my phone. I don't know nothing about my phone. Only thing I know about this phone is it's big and black. And we is finna go to this phone right here. We finna use Rashad's phone because my phone, I don't know how work my phone. After all this time, I don't have this phone. You done had this phone for about, what, four months, five months? So wait, you on this camera and this camera? Hey, I'm all over this motherfucker. <laughs> okay, I'm confused. What one should I cut off? Shit, let me see. Hold on, I'm confused. Yeah, would you press this button right here for this button right here, man. And we is finna go to this phone right here. We finna use the sharp phone because my phone, I don't know work my phone. After all this time, I don't like this phone. You done had this phone for about, what, four months, five months? So what, you on this camera and this camera? Hey, I'm all over this motherfucker. <laughs> okay, I'm confused. What one should I cut off? Shit, let me see. Hold on, I'm confused. Yeah, well, you press this button right here. Hooper. This button right here, man. Get off me. And then you turn it off. This is how we turn it off. We hit this button to turn it off. And then we just put it in the back. And we ain't got no list. Did you write this out? No, I didn't write no damn list. Oh, I'm just coming here and get some big cut ham. And you got some mayo? Look at all this mayo out here. What mayo? Oh, sandwich mean. mayo. Oh, oh no. We got to oh, I got some. We just gonna get, we need to get some light bread. You know, when you make a ham salmon, it's good. Wheat bread is good. But when you eat a whitening sandwich, a fish sandwich, or a ham salmon, a fried fat salmon, you gotta put it on light bread. Light bread means white bread. It's the best. It's absolutely the best. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna come after you, Jeremy. Ooh, <laughs> you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> I heard for when y'all come to the store, y'all get these. A lot of people, a lot of people don't get these white. These get these whites before the plan dinner. And wipe them off. These are good tissue paper wiping that hand. So uh, yeah, so I had to get him. Let me tell y'all something I used to hate. I hate when I used to be grocery shopping and people used to give me they like they been use the bucket that you want my car like no I can't stand all that hand heat all that heat right here the building they already I don't want that I want my own fresh bucket with the right temperature not 98.6 degrees on the damn bucket I don't want that sir and I wipe all this on just like you me get in that ad get in them homes get them homes <laughs> we on back of control. Anyway, but back to my what I was saying though. <laughs> see, she just got her bucket detention. Mm -mm. See that man, see that where the chrome virus is We need to wash it real good. So we up here at the deli now, about to get our sliced ham. What kind of ham? Wildflower ham. That look good. Yeah. Oven baked ham. Wildflower honey ham. Oh, that's the same one. <laughs> <laughs> so I think we're going to get a sample. I need a sample. And this right here is good too. That, uh, oh, that buffalo style chicken breast. Yeah. Hey, could I uh, taste a sample of the wildflower honey ham? What it is right here? Like yeah, that's roast beef. That's yeah. Good. If I get it, I'm gonna need to slice in a bowl. You want what? Slice me in a bowl. On the fifth floor. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Oh yeah, it's because you want it a little thicker. Yeah. yeah. So, but yeah, that's what we had. We had, uh, as you can see, food, lion. Yeah. Wait, I'm sorry, I didn't hear what you just said. 
Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Lower sodium. Yeah, I need lower sodium. But yeah, so um, we just in here. Uh, do we? I thought we already had some bread. Man, I want some light bread. That, light bread make a good sandwich and hold the sandwich together. That honey wheat? I don't want no honey wheat, just plain light bread. Why are you showing them all that big, that barbecue grill right there? The shot, y'all, the shot do not have a lot good. He's no, it's just. He had that folk gonna beat him up and he hold the camera like this. Ooh, they gonna beat you up. It's not about that. They gonna beat me up. <laughs> it's not about that at all. Anyway, he's good, good folks. No, I'm not. But yeah, so. You um, can turn it over so you can see you were eating the food. Uh, I can easily turn it around. Okay. Golly. This is my phone. Let me work my phone. That's what you should get. You should have got you a Samsung. I don't want that. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah, we're about to do a little taste test of this iPhone. ham. I got an iPhone. I own this phone. iPhone, okay. Now you're supposed to see. Get back, man. I'm not afraid. <laughs> it's good, too. All right. You said this is the wild wild little story. All right, let me get a half a pound of that. Slice it in the oil. Give me about four. Slice it in the oil. Um. How about the oven baked ham? I told him I want to get rid of the pig on that pork, on that turkey chop. <laughs> How about oven baked? Yeah, that's good. 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 You think that's good? I don't know. Mm. Well, you want that bruschetta inspired, <laughs> roasted turkey That's what they said, bruschetta? Yeah. Let's try that then. Yeah. It got a lot of seasoning. Yeah. It's got a season. That's a lot of seasoning. Could I try uh, one more and I'm going to be gone? <laughs> the bruschetta inspired ham right here. Turkey. I'm sorry, The bruschetta inspired turkey. Yeah. I don't taste so good. <laughs> but this, <laughs> this is good. Oh, this. Let me try. How did I get this in a three? And give me a pound of this. This is good, right here. I know. I picked it out. Mmm. That's really good. That flavor. You looking at you or me? Me? Mm. I'm telling you, Hobo. This is good. I like the seasoning of it. I now I want me some bread. Now, now I want me some real bread and some bun. And so what you gonna make? Now I gotta get some lettuce, tomato, onion, pickles. I want sub sandwiches. <laughs> now I want a ham sandwich. I'm just gonna make regular sandwiches. Yeah, I'm making just regular sandwiches. Regular sandwiches. Yeah. Good folks. When the last time you had some good cube steaks? I so want to buy these and cook them. I made these on a video a while ago. I want to buy these, but food line, your price is way too high. Y'all need to cut it. That don't make no damn sense. That don't make no sense. This price is too high. Look at that. This ain't even a pound of meat. $5. What the fuck? This ain't even five. This ain't a pound of meat. All oh, the meat too high. Anyway, I want to get these, and I want to cook them the way I cook them on uh, turkey chop Sunday. But I don't think I'm going to buy them, though. Anybody got some food something to see? <laughs> Holla at me. I ain't gonna buy nothing. I ain't gonna buy nothing. Now move out my way. Go down here and see they got some turkey chops. They got turkey chops? There? I'm looking. I don't see none. I don't see none. I think you had to go to Walmart and get them. 
Look at that turkey right here. Ooh, that turkey looks like it died again. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> that turkey is dead looking. All of them. All of them. Turkey burger. Ooh, we should try that one day. I don't want to try it. I don't want to be there to try it. I don't want no punk head turkey burger. I had it one time, it was okay, but I don't want to try it. And plus, I don't like to buy, I don't like to buy, if I'm gonna buy ground beef, you wanna eat ground beef no more, like this. I don't want them to pat it out for me. I want to be able to control my own patsation. Well, sometimes their patsation is better than your patsation. X. Right. Somebody put that damn X up from the uh, Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> Not Wheel of Fortune, uh, Family Feud. <laughs> So good folks, y'all did tell us about these Stanford, Connecticut sausages. So we gonna buy them and see how they taste. Now if they taste good, we gonna give y'all props. If they taste nasty, I'm cussing everybody out that ever subscribed to my channel. These sausages don't look good. They're like small intestines or something. Mm -hmm. uh -uh, yeah. <laughs> you think these good? Yeah. I know they're gonna be good, I can tell. Connecca. Okay, Connecca. Okay. Yeah, Connecca sausage. Are right, we gonna try them out? What you peeping for? Nope. Do y'all like pups? Low pup, high pup, or low pup? No, I don't want no pup. I don't want no. It's just how it is when you get inside of it. When you get some crumbs inside of it, you gotta pull out and rewash. <laughs> Damn, the man, this finger hurt. Look at the L. It's open like a vagina. It's open like a cootie cat. Damn. But I want pork free. That's all we get in. Yeah, I think that's it. When you come to the food line, you come in with an empty cart and you leave with an empty cart. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Now, y'all, I know I don't need these, but when you eat a good ham sandwich, you need some good chips to go with it. But it's gluten free. I don't work at what I need to be with and paying for. Shit, I ain't trying to beat my record. What is the scan control? Is it free? Oh. Five, twenty-nine. God, they're five dollars over there. Golly, that Kanachi, Kanachi sausages. I hope you. I just want to those. Oh, the one like Jack and the Box they have. One, curly fries. I'm put them in the air fryer though. I couldn't do this job for a living because I'm already ready to get out of here. You still got most stuff? She need win. I know win the lunch break. When my lunch break? Seven, Damn, seven, seven, nine. Damn, seven out of nine. Four, forty-seven. Yeah, man. Three, twenty-nine. Yeah, damn. <laughs> She's mental. I like this water. Yeah, that's the best water, I think. One, forty-nine. Yeah, man. <laughs> I love putting in another bag. What the hell? We ain't got about two bags of forty dollars. See, uh, -uh. everybody catch up me a dollar and I'll be all right. So, hood folks, you see, we didn't even buy that much stuff in here, and that bill was almost forty-one dollars. I know, I need this. But I scanned my card. And it I took that price down. I need a little bit, man. So <laughs> come here. Let me say what I need to say. You know, when I be watching slave movies. Like I was watching Mandingo back here, but the other one, the next one to Mandingo, was it Drift or Draft? I can't remember. But I was watching slave movies. And then when the slaves say, we breaking out tonight, we gonna kill Master. I'm not finna, I'm finna rebel against Master. And then an old house Negro, the old Sambo. Don't you do that, man. Don't make Master mad. Go on and act right and don't make Master mad. You need to not do that, man. Don't you make Master mad. Go on and act right so you won't make Master mad. That's the same energy I be feeling when I be walking out here with no mask on. From black folks. Go and put the mask on. Go make Master Man. Put it on. Go vote. Don't make Master Man. Comply. Take that shot. Don't make Master Man. That's how a lot of black folks be looking when they be too busy worrying about what the next black person doing. All right. the next person in general. Put your mask on. Don't you make Master Man. Y'all gonna make Master Man. Why? 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 Comply or die. No, we don't do that right here. If you want to live alone, mind your own. If you want to live alone, do your own thing. 
Too many facts. Y'all looking like slaves out here. Too many people looking like slaves. What are they doing? Oh, that's that bucket. Fuck bush. <laughs> Too many people looking like slaves out here. You better put your mask on, especially old black women. Ooh, they don't want to make massive mad because they don't want to cut out their friend benefit. Massive! I'm a good nigga, not massive. I'm a good nigga. I'm a good nigga, massive. Did you just use the word that you don't use? I don't even use that word, but there are a lot of black folks living with that when you walk around with no mask on. Uh oh! You can disobey mask. We use a good nigga, not mask. So, Hufo, we just got back to the house. And this is what I mean by my cut. This is what's sick right here. This is what I use to make my, I need to watch that. This is what I use to make my zucchini with. I got what you cut But I cut myself on this right here. Ooh, it still got blood on it. Look at that. Even though I put some damn bleach on it. Anyway. I watch it. But this is what I'm talking about, mandala. Ain't that what it is? Yeah, it's a mandolin. Mandolin. This little, this little thing right here is sharp. It's sharper than your teeth. It's just like your teeth, Rashad. Short teeth. That's a short teeth, yeah. <laughs> so, hood folks. Do y'all do this? Ah, look at this. You at the store. <gasps> Coronavirus is in my hand. And you take it and say, Ooh, I wonder, should I get these chips? You touching all on it. No, I want that chip. I want to see that get a little bit of shawl guy. Don't blame that on me. You Wait a minute. You went down there. Uh, uh, let me get my assimilation out of here. Damn it. Uh, I got the I got the coronavirus, the flu, the swine flu, gingivitis, everything all over this. Touch. So you come home. And you say, ooh, baby, these chips good. And you open them up. And you uh, yeah, you wash your hands off. And a lot of, I've seen a lot of folk. Don't be washing their hands. There's one person I watch on YouTube. I'm finna be shady. All they do is talk about folks need to put on their mask, but they go to a lot of restaurants and order food and they do not never wash their hands. And I'm saying, hmm. Anyway, it's all over the chips, babe. You walk, you take your hand, put it inside the chip, and now you eating it. Now you eating them. And all the virus going down your throat. I know you used to a lot of stuff going down your throat. I know you used to swallowing. But you be crying about what well, your mask up. <laughs> the mask work good, me. The mask work good, me. But we ain't stumbled what's going on to him. But y'all didn't come for the that. Y'all already know that. But this, I still do this on everything I buy. It may take a little time, but I still take my wipes and I still wipe all the stuff down. I'm not even a germaphobic like this, but I just think about, I just think back to this one time we was at Dennis. In Dallas, put this camera up here. Rashad don't know how to hold the camera, right? Can I get somebody to come hold the camera? Anyway, this one time we were <laughs> fat bitch. This one time we was at Dennis. I gotta show y'all this. Stay right here. Just stay on me. Don't move nowhere. I need me a director and a center photographer. We at Dennis, y'all. And I didn't order no coffee, but this lady, Mayo Mafia lady was making coffee and we were sitting there watching her making coffee and she did this. She was trying to get this thing out. Yo, these are the coffee filters. She was trying to get a filter out, but she couldn't do it. She did this. Lick her finger, she was able to get the coffee out. Ugh, I was so sick to the stomach. I was so sick to the stomach. I told her I don't want me because we finna order a burger or something. I didn't even want to go to Dennis. I said, no, nah, I'm all right. We'll go to Jack and Box somewhere. I'd rather, if you're gonna do nasty, don't show me. But anyway, so I'm finna sit here, clean my, products off one by one and then we're gonna make us a damn ham sandwich that's what I want I've been intermediate fasting all day I intermediately fast all day you got the heat on yes
let me stop playing with y'all. I only got four, four slices of ham. I got four thick slices too. Four thick slices. And how many sandwiches you want? Two. Well, I'm only one sandwich. We got some ham, and y'all saw that turkey we got. That turkey was good too, but it's thing. So when the last time y'all had a good ham sandwich? Have you had this bread bread before? No, this is my first time trying it. Me too. What is it, potato bread? Potato bread, whole, whole, whole wheat. wheat. I tried to get a lot, I, I should give you some, I wanted some real white bread, but, ooh, that looks good. Ooh, that looks good. You eat two sandwiches? Yeah. That greedy. Y'all see it weird that this dude eat more food than me, but he is smaller than me? Oh, thank you for finally saying the truth. In the bed, that's the only place. <laughs> 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 Let's pull them out and compare. That's why your back looks like a mattress. <laughs> I love my mayonnaise, olive oil mayonnaise. I use, like I said, I'm eating, I eat a lot of stuff. That am I the only one that when that grease pop on my hand, it don't bother me? It kind of feel kind of kinky. Hot grease when it pops me, most people are like ah, me it feels. Good. Thank you for letting me know, because I'm going to start pouring a little bit of hot grease on you every now and then. I might put some hot wax on myself. Ooh, look at that. Look at that thing. Yeah, that's a good thick cover there. I would, I should have made some damn biscuits. See, I like when that grease pop on my skin. It well, feels good. I got no shirt Ooh, I like when it got to get both sides. I hate when we had to go to a restaurant, and we tell them we want extra mayonnaise on the burger, and we had to, we had to say put it on both sides of the bun. Now that's one restaurant that I put it on. If you ask for extra, they put it on both sides of the bun without even asking. Who? A restaurant that I miss so bad. What? Whataburger. Oh yeah. What all you like on your ham sandwich? I like mayonnaise and mustard. You can put a little mustard on one of mine. And that's it. And that's my sandwich right there. Now, uh, some people ask, what was this right here? So when we making the cooking video Sunday, and I was, uh, I don't know what I was cooking, but this eye right here started burning. And next thing I know, it caught a fire just like that. If you have a grease fire, baking soda. This is baking soda. I need to, I need to clean this off. It should have been cleaned off by now. Every time we do a video, I wash off these things when we can do them. But for some reason, it get on, it get on the camera and show out. So this is baking soda. And baking soda will stop a grease fire. So you got a grease fire. Don't pour no water on it unless you're trying to be like left eye. You get it? <laughs> anyway, y'all, Rashad salmon. Look what he like his salmon. Cheese. I like a little cheese on my ham sandwich. You never had a ham and cheese sandwich? I don't like cheese on no ham sandwich. That's disgusting. I don't like cheese on chicken. I don't like cheese on nothing but what it's supposed to be on like a cheeseburger. That's it, but mm -mm. it's a lot of bend -aid. I like my salmon wet. We like our salmon to wet. Y'all should know that by now. And if y'all don't, y'all haven't watched it. And time. one other thing about my sandwich I hate, I don't like this part of the bread. God, I wish they did. I'm pretty sure they make bread without that, but I hate that part of the bread. That, I think it's probably going to cost more. Damn, we took out a big bite. Mmm! Mmm! Let's see. This is gonna be lunch and dinner. Tuesday, Wednesday. I'm not I'm gonna eat. We got a little bit more stir fry left. And we got zucchini spaghetti. Zucchini spaghetti left. So and then fried them will make some wings. And then we'll figure it out to that. Air fried wings. Get your protein. So, all I'm gonna do today is get through, we gotta wash our bed sheets. How many times a week, then, then nasty, how many times a week do you wash your bed sheets? I wash mine twice. I was about to say, we can do it about twice. Twice. Cause them bed sheets hold some stain. And some uh, funk. Funk too. And then the reason I asked that, because a lot of times, come in the light, get me in the light, Caroline. A lot of times people be like, you know, Y'all vlogs kind of lame. Y'all vlogs kind of whack. What kind of grown men be talking about washing clothes and sheets and washing powder and going to the dollar store and stuff like that? So my question I ask 
ladies, especially ladies and gentlemen too, do you teach your grown, well, your young sons about domestic stuff while they're young? And do you think that teaching your son about washing his own clothes, washing his own dishes, cleaning up after himself, do you think that's some like fruity stuff or some man law violations or some weak stuff? I personally don't. You know, ain't nothing, teaching, ain't nothing wrong with teaching your kids clean up after yourself, Rashad. I always do. 90% of the time. Y'all yeah, know what that means. No enlightenment. And I hate when people eat. I got something cold in my mouth. Yep. I cannot stand to see people. There's one reason I'm y'all. I can't stand to see people eat and have all that man they in their mouth. This is kind of one reason why I don't do mukbang. I know some people be chipping on high chew. But this actually high chew, it put flavor in your mouth. Now, I hate when people have stuff all over their mouth. That's why it's always hollering at this boy. Man, wash your mouth. You ain't been on the camera since you've been in the house. Nope. It's I told you what I got on. It's all a nigga, yo. I just got on my pants, that's it. I ain't got on no shirt. Why you ain't tell me I had my glasses on, man? You know I like to record a video without my glasses on. I'm be looking sexy in my glasses. Who the fuck? I'm still sipping on my blue Kool-Aid. You know Kool-Aid tastes better as it uh, sits up. What's your favorite flavor Kool-Aid? Mine used to be green. <laughs> yeah, green was good, but mine is grape. Grape is good, too. So... That's it. That's all we're gonna do. Like I said, go wash our sheets on the wash our sheets, wash the comforters, and we just gonna relax for the rest of the day. Edit this video out, and that's all I'm doing. Rashad, what did you got on? Uh, what you mean what I got on? Oh, you mean this thing? Get them. You mean this? Get these corners? Get them. Yeah, get them now. Go and get them. We want to see what it is. What that package look like? We want to see that package. <laughs> you stay off of that. <laughs> you ain't getting that. <laughs> but go teesprings.com. We got our we got our, yeah in our description on YouTube and on uh, Instagram. Go check us out. Get some merch, and uh, maybe you can look as clean as me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you do. Yeah, I'm just giving me some champ. Mm. Tell you your sandwich on the camera. Tell me what you think. Well, I already been out the door. Mm, oh, this with cheese? Yeah. Do y'all like cheese in y'all sandwiches? I tell you. Good. That ham good, y'all. That food line, I'm telling you, I hate the plug food line with that little ass, but they deli meats are good. And it's a little salty. Lower and sodium. it's lower sodium too, so we need lower sodium. Keep the blood pressure down, keep the heart pumping along. Mm-hmm. All right, folks, we finna stop blabbering on. We'll see y'all Friday. We're gonna have two, two food virgins coming Friday. And that's all we got left to say. You got anything to say? Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe, and press that ugly ass bell button that look like Jeremy's head. To get notified whenever we put up new content on our page. Where you going? Man, I'm finna go sit down. Peace up, folks. Peace up, folks. Look at all that trash over there. You need to get all that trash. Oh, them my clothes. I had them for the video, though. I'm naked, y'all. I'm naked. Now. I'm back naked again. No, I'm behind the camera. We'll see y'all next time, though. Peace. Peace. Look at that. <laughs>